Adam Marburger here, and I'm about to share some incredible knowledge with you guys and gals. So today I had a coach call, and the coach call was all about humility. How do we get from where we are right now to where we want to go? And I shared a story about where I was 10 years ago and where I am today, and what are some of the biggest factors? What did I change to get to where I am now? Where was I? What was I doing then? And what are some of the things that I'm doing now? And one of the first things I brought up was humility. The ability to understand that I'm not the best, that I don't know everything, that I can learn more, that life every single day is an opportunity to learn and to grow. When I understood this principle of humility and really practice it in my life, everything changed for me. Everything grew. My martial arts academy grew. My, my insurance agency grew. My real estate grew. Everything in my life, the people that I spend more time with now are extremely, extremely successful. I'm surrounded by some of the most incredible super achievers in the country. And it's because I humbled myself and I'm not afraid to reach out and say, hey, listen, there's something that you're doing that I want to do. Like, so where'd you, where, how'd you get to where you are? I just want to let you know that I've been following you. You've inspired me and you've motivated me to reach out to you. Raising my hand has gotten me to places I would have never been able to get to if I didn't raise my hand. So here's my message. I'm kind of rambling a little bit, but the, the message is simple. Humble yourself. Humble yourself. Understand that you do not have it all figured out. There's much more to learn. There's opportunity for growth. You can get better. You can get in better physical shape. You can get in better mental shape. You can surround yourself with a better circle of people that will elevate you and grow you to the next level. Humble yourself. Don't be afraid to reach out to those that are getting things done that you want to do. So for those that are absolutely crushing it, knocking the ball out of the park in your field, raise your hand, reach out to them. I'll tell you today, so I'm a jujitsu practitioner, here, I'm wearing a shirt. And so today, Court and I, we went and sparred with all of the uh, black belts over in St. Louis, over at Watson's Academy. And, you know, we left there, we had a big slice of humble pie. We got in the, in the vehicle afterwards, we talked about our rolling sessions and, and kind of what we did right, what we didn't do so right, and how can we get better? And the reality is, we walk out of that gym and we're humbled. You know, we have some good rounds, we have some not so good rounds, and we understand that we don't, we're just getting started. There's so much more to learn. You know, there's a guy that we train with by the name of Josh McKinney. I mean, I don't even feel like I'm doing the same sport. When I grapple with this guy, I'm not even doing the same thing he's doing. He just kills me. But when I get in my car and I go home, I'm like, you know what? He's a world-class black belt and I'm, and I'm hanging in there a little bit, right? So humble yourself. Understand that you do not have it all figured out, there's more to learn, there's opportunities for growth, and we need to connect with those that are doing the things that we wanna do. Humble yourself, that's my message. If we understand humility, your checks will get bigger, I promise you that. Have a blessed night.